Today I'm quickly going to talk to you guys about um, HIIT cardio. If you guys know, there's a big thing going on of doing HIIT cardio, which is high intensity cardio. But what happens often I see is I ask people, how long did you do your HIIT cardio for? And the response I got is like, oh I did it for like 30 minutes. Oh I did it for 40 minutes. Um, if you do it for 30 or 40 minutes of HIIT cardio, you must be like a Superman or something like that. Honestly, HIIT cardio is supposed to be done like about 20 minutes max, I think. Uh, because those minutes, those uh, 30 seconds or 20 seconds, depends what level you're at, supposed to be so hard that you will not be able to make it for 40 minutes of doing that. Or you're taking your breaks are way too long. So um, my suggestion is guys is when you're doing HIIT cardio, make sure you're doing the actual HIIT cardio not just running or not just you know jogging. So if you get on the treadmill, you gotta sprint for those 20 seconds so hard that when you're done with 20 seconds it feels like your lungs are about to fall off, your legs are so pumped from running that like you can't even move and then you hop off. Not like, oh well I ran and my heart rate went up over 130, I'm good, you know. That's not hit cardio, they're just running and then walking, running, walking. It's not high in, high intensity cardio, guys. Or um, if you get on a like, Stairmaster, um, Blast the thing all the way to the highest level possible, stay in it for 30 seconds, then bring it down to maybe level 2 or 3 and slowly walk, take deep steps, regain your breath again, rest, resting while you, you're resting but you're not stopping completely, your heart rate is still going up a steady pace and then blast it again for 30 seconds. So um, if you do that for 40 minutes, honestly you guys are going to be really really exhausted to the point where you won't be able to move so I ask you guys do do it for 20 minutes start off slow maybe do only five rounds you know then next day six rounds get up to 10 okay if you could do 10 rounds of real hit cardio you'll get results guys it's plus with diet and everything um, if you guys don't understand how to do hit cardio um leave uh, comments below comment it or things like that if uh, anything I will actually to help you guys out I will make for each equipment I'll show you how to do hit cardio uh, like treadmill, elliptical, stair stepper you know, bike, you could do it on pretty much any equipment you have you could use the floor, you know, you could use the ground anything, it could be done as long as you put all your intensity into it so make sure you guys get the real idea of hit cardio, what it is to feel it. I showed one of my clients what really hit cardio looked like and he goes, yeah, that's not what I was doing. I'm like, yeah, no wonder he had no results because you were not doing actual hit cardio. You think you were doing, but you were not forcing your body to change. You are not forcing your body to adapt. You didn't get the swell, uh, cell swelling in your legs when you're sprinting and you feel like you just did like 30 squats, your legs are so pumped. So um, get the right idea of what real head cardio is and what just, uh, you know, running is. I right, guess. Hopefully this tip helped. Uh, if you like it, just click like and uh, share with your friends uh, the videos and I'll keep making them. Hopefully help you guys out. Stay fit. Peace out.